six steps for creating a killer Patreon page for musicians. I've been on Patreon since about 2015. I've come up with a six step process, which I have found to be super successful at creating a Patreon page for musicians. Number one, determine at least four pieces of content. It could be a video, music, pictures, a blog, a podcast, whatever it is that you want to create, you need four of them. I don't suggest it all like four songs. Mix it up a little bit. You also wanna decide if that content is gonna be public or private. Number two, pick a release date for that content. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. My suggestion is to start at the beginning of the week, Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. That way, if you decide to make most things private, you have all week to pretty much promote it and people get really excited. If you decide to make some of it public, you can schedule it to be released to the public later in the week. Number three, set up one reward level. Once you get started with Patreon, you're probably gonna to wanna to have like 30 different levels. The trouble is actually following through and fulfilling all the requirements for all those different levels. It's easier to just get started with just one. I recommend a level at $5 per month. It's a nice low cost level for fans to get to know you and your music. Now, Patreon also gives you the opportunity to set it up as per thing or per month. I recommend per month. That's because most people want to know exactly how much they're spending each and every month. And if you have $3 per thing and you release 10 things, people might be a little bit concerned if they're having to pay $30. Now, technically speaking, Patreon gives you the opportunity to cap how much the fan spends each and every month. I could sign up at a $5 per thing level and then limit it to $5 per month, but it's complicated. So keep it simple. Your fans will appreciate it. Number four, write up an awesome description of who you are and what you plan to share on Patreon. Fortunately, you already did that in step one. Just look right up there and then you can spruce it up with cool text. Number five, record a fun video that quickly summarizes you and your music in a minute or less. Yes, you can go longer if you know all about video and are great at creating a short film type story. Cool. Amanda Palmer does that brilliantly. That's not me. I don't know much about video. I don't have the financial resources to hire someone who knows a ton about video. So I wanna communicate my message quickly and easily and in a fun, entertaining fashion. Number six, set up one milestone for patrons with a big reward when it is reached. Milestones are an excellent way to get interest and excitement, it gives you something extra to talk about when you're promoting your Patreon page. I've used them quite successfully with one of my Patreon pages, the Irish and Guilty Music Podcast. Whenever we hit a milestone, I release a two hour special of the podcast. Fans love that. But as an artist, I find it is sometimes difficult to get outside oneself and create milestones that are not about me, but about my fans. That is what the milestone is all about. It's not about you, it's about your fans. What do they want? What could get them excited? I started a Patreon page recently for my old band, the Bravi Nagin Bards. When we launched it, we set up a milestone. For $200, we would start recording our first new music in 10 years. That reward was quickly reached thanks to the excitement and energy that the milestone and the idea of our band creating new music added. It is difficult and you do have to think outside of yourself. Remember that. There you go. If you follow these six steps to create your Patreon page, you will have a good launch. The caveat is that you do need fans. If you don't have any fans, you're not going to go very far. And if that's the case, I might recommend Aurelio Voltaire's Future Rockstar Handbook video. You can find a link to it right up there. Meanwhile, I will continue to share music marketing promotion tips on my channel right there. I hope you found this video fun and informative. If you did, please like it, maybe even share it. Post any questions or comments down below and check out bardscrier.com for more music marketing and promotion tips, all for free. So thanks again, Slancha.